look. We went to three Cochrane schools and talked to students in grades four to eight about organic waste. We helped the kids sort through five days of school waste. We separated all the material in the trash into piles for paper, metals, plastic, returnables, and organics. The students saw how much of their waste can actually be diverted from landfill and how much organics is going into landfill. Is that good? No. That's horrible. The students learned that organic waste doesn't break down at the landfill. It releases methane, a greenhouse gas that is 23 times more potent than carbon dioxide emissions in the atmosphere. And it produces leachate, a liquid that drains or leaches from a landfill that can potentially flow directly into our groundwater. When we divert organics from landfill, we can turn waste into healthy living soil. With new bins for organics and a handy reference chart, students now have a place for all their organic waste. Students just have to check the lists to know what goes in each bin. The charts make it easy for kids to know what goes in each bin. Now that they know, kids in Cochrane can also help sort organics properly at home. Hi guys! Hi! We are here again. After using the charts to separate their waste for a few weeks, we went back to the school and sorted their waste again. We separated the material and the results were much better. Was well, 68%. Now, we are at 32%. Okay, so it's less than half than what we found last time. So guys, you did an awesome job. Great, 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 yes. Big cheer for you guys. Good job, good job. Students learn that when we send our organic waste to a processing facility, it is turned into compost, a soil amendment very rich in nutrients. Raw organic materials such as animal waste, food scraps and yard waste, once composted, makes a great fertilizer. Compost is a rich source of organic matter. Organic matter plays an important role in keeping soil fertile and helps farms be more sustainable. We can also use compost for our own gardens and lawns. Plants love it. When we turn organic waste into compost, we close the loop and return organic material to the earth. The first waste sort, I think, opened all of our eyes. It comes down to, in a sense, that we want our students to feel like they're stewards of their community. And they have to learn that organic waste can be recycled. And I would like them to embed it not only here while they're at our school in elementary, but part of who they are in their environment and as they grow older into adulthood. I prefer to look at it as generations to come, and I really think that they're the drivers of this, uh, be, and they are. It'll be tricky at the beginning, but once we get used to doing it, we'll start doing it a lot. It's just gonna be normal. We did presentations, so we hope that the messages got through. It can really just um, make a big difference. Keep organics out of the forest! 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 Go to cochrane.ca slash organics or call the Waste and Recycling Hotline at 403-851-2277.